Hey guys, just at the, uh, the hive today. I wanted to check on the bar that um, broke off in my last video. And it actually completely drawn out now. What's it been, three, four days since I've uploaded? Anyways, they completely drew out that uh, bar, which is amazing. Super fast. Just taking a quick look here if this focuses at uh, my bees doing a little cleaning. Um, they were. No, it's still going. So this bee is not trying to damage the other bee. It's literally doing a thorough clean. Basically, this is what you want to see in your hive. Um, this bee's cleaning out the fur, checking under the wings, check the abdomen. Um, they'll nab any Roa if they find any. Coming over to another bee. Oh, it's, it is still being cleaned. Okay, cool. This is uh, just a different location on the top of my bars. And uh, this bee was just getting thorough cleaned by two other bees. Let's go around the abdomen, everything. Now, I've had these hives going for three years and uh, haven't really had any roa issues that were major. I've known of their presence in my hive. I've taken out um, drone comb every year, uh, trying to get rid of the mites. And uh, I've also done a lot of um, brood breaks. So I would requeen the hive basically let them grow a new queen, there'd be a big brood break, that'd slow down the Varroa's progress. And typically that's every um, every June, I'd say, i do a brood break. There'd be a ton of uh, enclosed workers ready to hatch out, and I'd split the hive and take the queen out, so they'd have 30 days plus of a nice break away from uh, the Varroa. It's kind of interesting, there's a bee right here. The big, big orange globule on its leg is actually a sap or a propolis. And she is going to probably seal up some of these bars with that, help, you know, stretch it out and chew it along the bars, make it really nice and sticky. It's pretty fascinating. There's more cleaning going on. Uh, if I can spot this, oh no, never mind. There was, but anyways, this is just the uh, top of my bees. There's so much random communication up here, shaking, moving. This is on top of my hive. It's quite the large cluster. The bees up here just hanging out. It seems like it's a good area for them to like bask and clean each other, who knows what else they do up here. Obviously like, I do have a bit of an ant problem. I wouldn't say it's a problem, there's just ants around. So there's these carpenter ants that like to nest under, um, so this part closes here by the hinge there. They like to bring their eggs up. The odd bee gets crushed, it happens. Um, Anyways, the bees will actually defend their colony and attack the ants and get rid of the uh, eggs and the ants and whatever, you know, it's all good. Makes them a little bit aggressive sometimes. There's another instance of cleaning going on in this hive. This is the third random instance of bee cleaning on top of these bars. Uh, where'd they go? Right there. Very thorough. You can see the other bee using its antenna, smelling, looking for mites, whatever. It's funny, in cases of robbing, you actually see bees doing a similar kind of attack, though, on another bee. <clears throat> and they'll be actually chewing the wings off of the bee, biting the wings, trying to make them immobile. Pretty interesting. Not for your hive if it's being attacked by, you know, robbing or anything, but still, like, this is obviously cleaning. 
right in between the head and the uh, thorax there. Whatever she collected, she's nibbling away. Now, this is excellent behavior. I really hope to see a lot more of it in my hives. Um, this is just our carnelian, uh, a uh, carnelian queen that I originally had three years ago. That's produced, well, her daughters in every hive. Not sure if there's any other bee colonies around that they've mated with, but it's, uh, I mean, there's probably some wild colonies around or other beekeepers that they've crossbred with, but who knows. These bees are obviously a very clean species or breed. Oh, look at that. There's a drop right there. I wonder if that's just a random drop of uh, sap from something. It's very bright. I wonder where that's collected from. I have no idea. Is that another bee, or the same one? Looks like the same bee. Uh, I'm totally out of, boat, out of like sight here. Yeah, anyways. It's like spa day on top of my hive. Pretty interesting.